Hi, this is Mrs. K, and today we are going over non-sterile dressing change. Use paper or towels with soap and water to clean the over the bed table. One swipe with a new towel to wash and to dry. If you're using cleanser wipes, you must follow the manufacturer dry time. Set up non-sterile drape on the over the bed table. Tape a plastic bag over the bed stand. Wash your hands, identify the patient, introduce yourself to the patient, and explain what you're doing and why. Position the patient comfortably and make sure the surrounding area is clean and tidy before you start. Put on clean gloves and place a waterproof pad underneath the client. Remove dressings and discard into plastic bag. If gauze adheres to wound, moisten with sterile solution to loosen from the wound bed. Remove tape from skin, pulling tape toward wound slowly and gently. Lift the soiled side of the dressing away from the client's view to avoid upsetting the client. Determine the amount, color, odor, and consistency of any drainage. Observe surrounding skin and wound sites for redness, heat, swelling, type and color of exudate, odor, and eschar. Measure size and depth as appropriate. Length times width times depth in centimeters. Wash hands thoroughly. Check your facility protocol if hand sanitizer gel can be supplemented for hand washing in between glove changes. Open all sterile dressings to be used. Prepare cleansing solutions as ordered. Put on non-sterile gloves and proceed with gentle cleansing of wound. Start with inner portion of wound and move in a circular motion away from the center. Use a clean gauze pad for each cleansing motion. Gently pat the wound dry with a clean dry gauze observing the same technique. Discard cleaning materials and gloves into a plastic bag. Apply any ointments as ordered using a tongue depressor. Do not touch the wound bed with your hands. Remove gauze dressings from previously opened packages and place on wound. If using bio-occlusive or other similar dressings, remove gloves first. Tape all four sides to hold in place from previously torn strips. If skin is sensitive, wrap dressing with roll gauze or curlic snugly and secure in place with tape. If requires frequent dressing changes, especially abdominal wounds, Montgomery straps are recommended. Reposition patient, place collite within reach and place bed in lowest position. Wash your hands.
Notify physician of adverse reactions, signs and symptoms of infection, or lack of wound healing and document. Thanks for watching Angelus Institute Sims Lab. Have a great day.